Hello, 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 everyone. It's a Tuesday. We don't usually do a run on a Tuesday, but Tuesdays, uh, we call them Tickler Tuesdays over here because we took your funny bone. We do, we do new stuff. We pull a bunch of pranks on Tuesdays. Tuesdays are our prank days. Um, when I was young on April Fool's Day, I used to do this prank where I would draw like just like a mark on my cheek with like a marker or like makeup or something. This is when I was pretty little. Uh, and then people would always come up to me on April Fool's Day and be like, hey, you have something on your face. And I would be like, what? Oh, good one. It's April Fool's. And then they'd be like, no, you really do. And I'd be like, I'm not falling for it. It's April Fool's. Good one. Good one. Uh, but the trick was I was April fools them because I was in on it. I knew there was a thing on my face. It was all a ruse, and they were trying to be nice, decent people. Do you ever notice how a lot of pranks are just people being nice? <laughs> it's a lot of people, like, trying to help you or doing something nice, and you just, like, spitting in their face, basically. It's kind of what pranks are, and that's what we do here on Prank Tuesday, Tickler Tuesday at Giant Bomb. Anyway, we're going to get started here, so I'm going to fade it to black. Uh, don't pull a prank on us because we're nice, good people. Bye. Folks, viewing audience, here we are. We are ready to do the pre-show, and then we'll be ready to do the run, but this is not the run quite yet. This is where we check the mics and the video and the audio to make sure everybody can see us and hear us because we only get one shot at this, and that will be to beat Alter Beast. I'm joined by Dan Riker. Hey, that's me. How are you? I'm doing great. How yeah. are you? I'm excited. We had a, a bit of weather yesterday, which yeah. postponed the run. But what's one more day when you're going to make history? I slept in that slush. Slept in that slush. On the concrete, in the cold, hard ground. Did the you earth. get into the show? Wait, no. I did. I got like amazing like front row, <gasps> dead center, Yay! like most perfect. That's good. I mean, for an actual good episode. Yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, was, I, didn't watch, uh, I watched some of the bits from that. That was different slush, though. That was slush that snowed and then melted and it snowed again on Sunday. Oh, okay. Yeah. It snowed yeah. a few my, times. Yeah, my weekend was a giant blur. Yeah, uh, while you were sleeping in slush. Uh, yes. Uh, that was a that was a decent some decent bits in that uh that SNL. Yeah, the Bodega Saturday thing was live. good. Yeah, um, that was all right. It, that was a production. It was, and like seeing that live with the like rotating stage and all that stuff, they had to bring yeah. the toilet up into the ceiling. And, and all it was that uh, stuff. Mr. Mulvaney. Uh, Mulaney. John Mulaney. Yes. Mulvaney. Mulvaney. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, it's it's Cheers. great. Um, amazing seats. It was it was a pretty solid show. Um, I, I like, Bill Hader was there. I love Bill Hader. So okay. Yeah, it was good stuff. It was fun. Well, it's nothing compared to what we're gonna do. It's not altered. Did they beast. did they beat altered beast? Uh, actually, before they did like a, a dark match, basically beforehand, where they beat altered. Did beast. Francis yeah. McFlaney? It was, it was Kenan and Lauren. Francis played, McFlaney uh, beat altered beast. Yep, yep. Okay, he's he's my favorite comedian. Francis McFlaney. Oh, he's trying to say John Mulaney. Uh, he's, he had a funny stand up. He's, Those he's kid, that kid's funny, and I think he's going places. That kid. <laughs> Kid who just sold out Radio City Music Hall like 19 nights in what a row. What has he done? He's played an animated pig in yeah. a cartoon. Right. Please. Yeah. He's great. Please. Uh, yeah. He's got a. He's got a. He's got a delivery that is oh, both yeah. funny and awkward. Uh, yeah. Yeah. He kind of nails it. He nails it. Mm -hmm. uh, that's my review of comedy. Oh yeah. I hope you it's enjoy stick it. Around. Uh, the comedy. Yeah. And no. our, our new comedy podcast that we're gonna do. Yeah. That is called. It's gonna stick around. Mm -hmm. It's our very first comedy podcast here. Very nervous about it. I'm not on it. No. I didn't make the no, cut. <laughs> no, no. We're going to learn. Uh, you're coaching us. That's the whole thing. Uh, and you're going to see if we can be funny. It's going to be old man comedy. It's just going to be like George Carlin and Lenny Bruce stuff. Mm, I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> That's pretty old. That's old for me. What's a Lenny yeah, Bruce? Give me a Lenny Bruce. I actually don't know. Number. I just know he was very famous in the 50s and he used to cuss a lot and smoke. That's pretty much all I know. Yeah. I don't think yeah. I've ever seen his bits. I've seen no. Carlin bits. I like Carlin. Yeah. 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 Carlin Pryor. Oh, the, the greats are those he's part of the greats Lenny uh, Bruce Carlin and Pryor no Lenny Bruce he's like kind of I, think he's he's, I feel like he was like, like a little more like less mainstream yeah, yeah. yeah you know who I don't like like that punk. everyone likes yeah, he's who, not funny. who you like but that everybody likes my dad's yelled at me for years because I've never found this guy funny he's dead but can you guess I'm uh, uh Bill Hicks sorry Bill Hicks he's not Bill funny Everyone well, fucking loves Bill Hicks. He's not funny. He's just fucking rants and preachy, and he know. died of uh, smokes, smoker stuff. Uh, I don't know if I know <laughs> he died Bill of Hicks. smokes. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know Bill Hicks? No, I'm not sure. I don't know Bill Hicks either. I even Googled him, and this face is not familiar. Oh wow, he's you're one of those Tool guys. I think Tool always used to quote Bill Hicks. Everyone I knew that liked Tool, Tool? also liked Bill Hicks. Wait, Tool quoted a comedian? I think Maynard Mullaney or whatever his name is. Maynard Mullaney, my Hicks favorite fan. comedian. <laughs> yeah, I uh, don't like Bill Hicks. I never have. He's not funny. 
He was dead, but he it's, was not it's kind of hard for me to imagine Maynard smiling or Tool d- telling well, that's a the joke. Thing. It's like Bill Hicks is like, oh, but it's like it's really intellectual. Like, oh, he's really talking about. Him. I feel like Tool would be way more into like Stephen Wright or like Stephen Wright's know, great. I yeah, love like kind of like just like yeah, ludicrous. Like, he just gets like, it. Well, just like, like yeah, extension cords or like the Tedberg stuff, like yeah, observational, whatever. Yeah, yeah. kind of thinky pieces. Uh, Bill Hicks is really thinky in an annoying way. All right. Well, did he? Uh, he was more thinking than comedy. Did he like ever that. host SNL? No. Mm. He's on Letterman a bunch. Mm. Yeah. How are we looking, Abby? Looks good to me. Yeah? We okay. ready to roll? Okay, I think so. Let me uh, loosen up because we're going to beat this game. Mm-hmm. Oh, I can't anymore. That's it. My neck That's actually does feel bad. I'm ready to go. Okay. Right. Here we go. Bye. See you on the other side. See ya.